사무실에 볼까? 아! The infamous Sonny Wu. <laughs> That's me, infamous and notorious. Glad you could come by. Ricky's told me all about you. This is King. What's good? He's producing Vivian Liu's next big hit. Yeah, it's gonna be hot, man. Way here's the real deal. A bona fide tribe killer from the streets. Cleavers, guns, castrations, whatever you want. Okay. <laughs> Way. Why don't you take King out on the town and show him around? Yeah, anytime. It's like one big playground, man. Nothing's off limits. You want to pick up some girls, get nasty, done. And we wait, no one will bother you. Nobody fucks with Sun on Yi. Yeah, well, I mean, actually, that sounds all right. If you don't mind showing me around. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I wish I could go with you players, but business calls. All right, cool, man. Yo, it was real nice to meet you, Sonny. Let's hit the streets. Let's do it. Ricky. Listen to this. I've been thinking. We need to get her a movie role of some sort. Hey, I think we'll start at the K bar. The VIP room should give us what we need. Hey, it's your town, man. So you producing for Sonny? Yeah, just this one time. And that guy's a piece of work. He's a fucking clown, you ask me. <laughs> I'm glad you said it first. But he does good business, makes everyone a lot of money. But as far as his personality goes, uh, uh, good to know we're on the same page. The fact is, you know, I got some other business to discuss. But I don't think my partners back in the states will want to be in bed with that guy. What kind of business? I got friends, guys I grew up with. They got a real good import and retail thing going. Yeah, but they could use a good Hong Kong act. Access to that good Asian product, you feel me? It's the reason I took the producing here was I heard Vivian on later connections. They are. It's me. Uh, well then, I guess this is gonna be like one of them old school business meetings. When you show me around town, you try to figure out if we a good fit.
Good evening, gentlemen. We'd like the VIP karaoke room. It's right this way. Hey, what's new? Yo, hold up. And don't tell me you and me is gonna sing to each other. I mean, I'm here for the local flavor, but not that local. Let me find us the right kind of audience. Hey there, what's your name? Katushka. I'm Wei. But listen, I saw you looking at my friend and I figured you realize he's a famous American celebrity. And I, I just wanted to ask if you mind keeping it a secret. <laughs> Ooh, how can I say no? Well, if you're not doing anything, maybe I can buy you silence with a drink. Want to join us? <laughs> That's very nice of you. So you're from Russia? Yes. <laughs> How'd you guess? Ah, call it a hunch. Oh, you. <laughs> Here, have a seat. I'm gonna find a few more people to join us. Hello, ladies. Hey, Mr. VIP. Want to buy us girls a drink? <laughs> I don't know. My friend and I are gonna enjoy your company? Try us on and see what you get. <laughs> All right, why don't you join my friend and me? I'll be in in a second. You okay, miss? Hey, poor guy, that my girl, so why do you fuck off? I'm son on ye, motherfucker. Now get out of here before I break every bone in your body. Oh uh, man, no, sorry, I didn't know who you were. Guy seemed like he was getting a little pushy. Oh, we get that a lot. You work here? Yes. So, you allowed to join the customers for a drink? Oh, that sounds nice. By the way, I'm Wei. I don't think I've seen you here before. I'm Iliana. Yeah, yeah. I usually don't come to places like this. I'm here for my friend. Well, if you ever want to hang out at places not like this, let me know. I'd like that. Can I call you? Sounds good. Thanks. Give me a call sometime. Damn, way. <laughs> Who knew Hong Kong was full of such beautiful women? <laughs> Friendly, too. How do you not know Hong Kong had beautiful girls? You just had to come to the right place. Well, I expect you girls to make sure King never makes that mistake again. <laughs> you can count on us, baby. We love American men, <laughs> don't we, Tina? All right, Wei. <laughs> Why don't you show us what you got? Come on, Wei. Let's see those lungs. <laughs> well, I'll show you mine if you show me yours.
Yeah. Hey, wait. Hey, come get a picture of this, will you? Way here has been promising me a taste of Hong Kong. <laughs> I'll give you a taste. You know, in the States, I'd have to take you to... Let's bounce. And you know what? You give good tourists, Wes. <laughs> Where's my town? Least I can do. No way. Don't think I'll forget that, man. Come on. My people will like you, huh? You got the right feel. Too many motherfuckers think all you gotta do is jump bad and wear the right colors. Nah. Business is a business. You feel me? You gotta be in it with the right people. Yeah, I can see you fitting right in in the States even. Yeah. If you ever want to change the scenery, I'll keep that in mind. There you are. I've been waiting for you, a stable guy. Stand back. Stand back. This is a fucking cake. shit you got going on. Remind me not to fuck with you. Alright, so listen. I'm going back in a week or so. Alright? I'll tell my boys I got the man for you. Alright? They'll want to start slow, but I'm guessing they can move as much product as you can ship. Well, this could be huge, man. These boys got some big ideas, too. I'm talking all the legit shit their money goes into. Gotta go somewhere. You feel me? And the feds back home are really cracking down. Brothers might be looking for a little offshore stash. Yeah. And the man who set that up, kept it safe. Yeah, he had a whole river of green to deal with. You feel me? Well, I could swing that for you. I still got contact stateside. We could set up the other side of things. Working movies, wait. Nah, too much bulls. I mean, look at Sunny Walk. Nah, man. Come on, that's what's good about it. Everybody's a fucking moron. You come in with muscle and money, and you too can call the shots. You got a point. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Really. It's real cool to meet you. We'll see you around. Yeah, for sure. Hopefully first night of many. Well, then. Looks like this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. <laughs> All right, man. Take care. I don't mind you fucking her. It's one of the perks 
But she has to understand the consequences if she disappoints me. Are we clear? Of course, Sonny. You're not getting attached, are you? A man of your caliber? You don't need to worry about that. I hope not. Way, come in, have a drink. You ever fuck some famous pussy, Way? Not yet. Maybe one day. <laughs> it's a trip, man, let me tell you. You drive by one of those billboards the size of a building, and you tell yourself, I'm going to her place, bend her over the table, and mmm, and then you do it. There's no other feeling like it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, speaking of stars, I need to go pick up Vivian. Let Wei do it. You and I have more business to discuss. How about it, Wei? Think you can handle a smoking hot starlet for the day? Uh, sure. I you know, as long as Ricky doesn't think I'm moving in on his territory. No, nah, of course not. Here, take my car. <laughs> you take good care of my little starlet. Go ahead and fuck her if you want. Just don't damage the goods. Ricky sent me. Didn't he tell you? No, I was expecting Ricky. Everything okay? Everything is not okay. Is it wrong of me to want to see my boyfriend? Why do I have to put up with this? No, Vivi, it's not wrong. And you put up with it because Ricky loves you. But... But what? Since your boyfriend isn't driving, I get to sit in front. <laughs> Why are the bad ones always so good looking? I'm Sandra. What's your name again? It's Way. Ricky talks about him a lot. Oh, all nice things, I'm sure. And you're here to basically do whatever we want? Uh, something like that. What do you have in mind? Hmm. Do you have steady hands at high speeds? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I can provide references if you like. Uh, are you trying to talk him into one of those street races you always go on about? So what's the deal, Way? You a gangster like Ricky? He's not a gangster, don't say that. Let's say I'm as much of a gangster as Ricky. Oh, that's too bad. Recently I've wanted to date a gangster. Well, maybe I'll see if I can find one for you. That would be nice. What's Ricky doing anyways? Why is he too busy? I don't know. Something with Sonny. Sonny? That guy's a creep and a perv. Sorry, Vivi. It's okay. What? What'd he do? Nothing. But he tried. I was at a party on Wallace Chun's yacht. I was like... 16. I got so high. <laughs> Great. That's him. That's him. Pull up. Hi, Alex. How are you? This is your new boyfriend? Not yet. Why? Are you jealous? Of this guy? Hey, so Sandra says you like to race. How about it? Now, if you win, I'll let you take the girls home. Way? I'm not sure how much that's worth. Okay, we race for the girls and a hundred thousand. Sure, I'll take your money too. You racing with the girls in your car? The extra weight will slow you down, idiot. Think of it as your head start, Alex. Because you're going to need it. Think of it as your head start. I'll show him. This is going to be great. All right, all right, all right. Vivian and I won't talk. Oh, 
how to drive. Just over there. Well, thanks for the fun time. Yeah. That was fun, Way. <laughs> thanks. Anytime. Vivi, give Way my number and tell him he can take me out on a second date. Sandra says you can take her on a second date if you want. Yeah, I got that. Thanks. Thanks for taking us out today. It was my pleasure. I need your help. 
Yeah, sure. What's going on? My friend Katushka, she's gone missing. Nobody's seen her in a week. Katushka doesn't have a visa. She's... she's illegal. Girls like her go missing all the time, but usually they don't have anywhere to go for help. I'll check it out. Would you? Oh, thank you. I can't believe you're arguing with me on our anniversary. You're the one with the sore feet. We should.